Hey everybody, welcome back to Trinity Dairy. Don't forget to like and share the video, subscribe to the channel, check out our merch store. We'll have a link in the description for that. You can also follow us on Facebook and Instagram. Today is January 26th, 2024. It's about 36 degrees right now. It's been really warm. Um, it's supposed to keep getting warmer, I think. Some days up in the mid to upper 40s coming up, so definitely in a heat wave. Um, what we're working on today, we're gonna move some calves out of the pens in the back of the barn, get some pens cleaned, haul some manure. Um, we've got some calves back there that should have probably been out of those pens like a month ago, but that was, we were in that really cold and kind of nasty. We had the wet, warm, wet weather over Christmas. Then we got a cold snap, so I didn't want to move those calves and stress them out. But now with this nice warm weather and, uh, kind of things have mellowed out a little more i think we'll get some of them moved i've already got a bedding pack in that little red barn when we had some switch cows in there so i think we'll uh we'll just put them older calves in there and uh that should be nice for them stay dry in there and then we can get the pens in the barn cleaned out so we're going to get the john deere fired up put that on the spreader and haul some manure I got the spreader hooked up, pulled up there. The boys can start filling that. I got to go put some hay out for the cows and then they can go out today. Should have their silage all cleaned up now. They got a few open pens in there to get started with.
I got that load ground, I ground a full load. Um, I wasn't going to, I was just gonna grind a little bit because I was worried it might be wet. But I don't know, there was all kinds of dust coming out of the mill and it seemed really dry coming out. It slid good in the wagon. And the last batch that I ground, I had just left that in the mixer and that stuff, I had a little bit on the front that heated a little. I think that it got some sun from the front of the shed maybe, but otherwise that did well too. So since it was grinding good and it seemed dry, I ground a full load. I gotta get going to work pretty soon, so I'll have to unload this in the bin when I get back. But we'll pull this up in the yard and we'll see how the boys are doing with their calf pen cleaning. Well, it got about three quarters of the spreader loaded so far. I think it's pretty well packed in there. We're not gonna go, we're not gonna heap it up over the beater because I'm gonna be, uh, we're gonna be spreading this on the hay field, so I don't want big clumps out there being that's just a single beater spreader we'll keep it about level with the beater so we'll see how they're doing in here how's it going yes. what do you got these first two cleaned out yes. perfect oh Getting Demi's pen all cleaned out? Yep. Got much left? Not much. Hey everybody, we're back. It's the next day. I'm just getting our projects from yesterday carried on to today, getting them wrapped up before chores here. Um, we got that load of corn that I ground yesterday. We got that unloaded last night. That went good. I got a little bit of video of unloading it, but it was dark by the time we got to that but uh got a pretty good pile in here stuff turned out nice i did add a i've got a product from our feed company it's called appetite it's it's um i'm not exactly sure all what's in it a bunch of antioxidants and different things like that uh, but it's supposed to be that if you if you're worried about any mold in your feed you can feed that and it's supposed to help that get through the cow without any health effects from the mold and not that i don't know if there's any mold in that corn or not but it's better to put that in than to uh, take a chance with it so we dumped a bag of that in there and um, got that mixed in so we don't have to worry about that the kids are, Jessica's just wrapping up cleaning her heifer's pen. The other calf pens, the boys finished cleaning this afternoon. They had some 4-H stuff this morning. The older two kids were at. We got the bigger calves out of the barn pens and into this little side barn here. So they've got a lot more room in here. Nice bedding pack. I got to bring them some hay and water in here yet, but uh, they're all nice and cozy. Right? Yep. So yeah, got that done. Um, got some manure hauled on the fields. I'm gonna be probably this week going to be cleaning out. It's been so warm and it's still supposed to be warm. That heifer barn up on the hill where the bigger heifers are really, really badly needs to be cleaned. Uh, they're staying nice and dry, but 
they're getting such a high bedding pack they gotta almost kneel down to reach their <laughs> their grain so um get that cleaned out and we can start that bedding pack over again that'll be uh, good to get that done so hopefully we can get that cleaned out this week i've got some more straw coming i gotta chop some more straw up into the hay barn because we're just about out of our straw up there and i i only have one bale left to chop so i got a hold of ray he's coming up this way anyway so he was going to throw a few extra bales on for me so i'll probably get that picked up tomorrow and uh, we'll be chopping that here this week too so anyway hope you enjoy the video i want to thank everybody for watching and we'll see you in the next one mm -hmm. right yeah. you got a pig nose you're all dirty yeah. look at that what did you do rooting around in the mud yeah <laughs> Ha, 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 ha.